I'm Jimmy, and welcome to my very spooky Halloween episode! <laughs> I'm gonna eat bugs. So I really like the box on these rainbow colored earthworms. And look, the card is unpunched. So, you know, that's added value, right? Best by 1226, 2019. So very timely stocking stuffer. Why is there an expiration date? I mean, this is basically just f tackle. Made in America with genuine insects. So oh, good, cause you know, I'm definitely not putting foreign insects in my mouth. Because MAGA! Every one of them had a mother. Oh my god, it smells like dirt. This can't be edible. Let me read the box. Oh, f I got worms. It just tastes like sour. Oh my god. Ah, oh, it's really sour. It tastes like one of those candy straws. <coughs> it's in the throat. <coughs> Ah, uh, it's really hard to chew. Oh my god, that's... Uh, oh my god. It's really sour, and I actually like sour, but it's so f wormy. <laughs> I mean, it. it's basically... I mean, honestly, it's basically like a candy straw. I'm trying to put a spin on this. I really am. But there's just something of biting into this that's so terrible. <laughs> All right, so I have a sucker that is filled with ants. Oh, gross. Banana. Next, I have these chocolate dipped insects. <laughs> Honestly, I'm actually okay with eating crickets, but it says insect larva. Larva. I'm not okay with that word at all. Chocolate has been around since the early 1500s. Insects have crawled the earth and into mouths since the Stone Ages. So, yabba dabba don't. I really should have spent more time writing these puns. See, these don't bother me too much because they're covered in chocolate. I mean, I know they used to be alive and, you know, swimming around dogs' nuts and stuff, but, like, I, I can't tell what they are. They just look like something that would be in, like, Grandma's chocolate bowl. Let's go ahead and try one. Okay, so these chocolate-flavored insects are not bad at all. Let me put the other ones back in the, uh... Why am I trying to save these? I'm actually rather curious to try these. I do have to be honest. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Let me check something. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Thank God. These dead bug chips are gluten-free. I was really getting triggered there. Did you see me? Do you see me getting triggered? Contains more B12 than salmon. Salmon? Salmon. I, I've always had trouble with that. Gluten-free, nut-free, dairy-free, soil-free, whey-free, cholesterol-free, non-GMO corn, and zero grams of trans fat. All just dead f bugs. Hashtag eat bugs. Who wrote this sh Me? Oh my god, it does not smell edible. Doritos. If you have crustacean, shellfish, allergies, you may also be sensitive to crickets. One cricket per chip. Made in the USA. MAGA! <laughs> God, I ain't spitting out Crystal Pepsi no matter what the f*** in my mouth. Ugh. Oh God, stick on my Ah, yes, that's a full of 
presto, dino DNA. Because Grant's like me. He's a digger. Okay, so these are gross. It's like I pick it up and like shake it around and there's all like little like loose limbs and legs and abdomens and shit. It's like these little guys used to be alive. Just and shitting all out in the open. Okay, so let's give these crickets a smell test. Oh my God, they smell like crickets. Oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> I swear, so <laughs> for a second, I thought it moved. <laughs> I thought these dead <laughs> crickets moved. <laughs> okay, so you're, you're oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Courage. So I said I'd do this. So I'm going to do it, and I want you all. This is this this is. A, I'm not going to cut away. Okay, we're not going to cut to some toy commercial from 1985. I'm going to reach out and grab one of these dead crickets, and then I'm going to take it back and put it in my mouth, and we're all going to share this moment together. This is so important. Here we go. This one. Okay. It's pretty f good. Oh God, I thought that one was alive. <laughs> I thought that one was alive. Oh my God, that was terrible. That was terrible. I need a big view for rallies. Because mega, happy Halloween everyone.